Hello, I'm Michael Diamond, and you're watching Muscle Central. Okay, this video, I'll be talking about Sean Roden, uh, and uh, what if, what if his legal issues uh, are resolved, and they're resolved early enough in the year for him uh, to have enough time to prepare for competition later in the year. We got two competitions, two big competitions. Um, we got the Rocks Athleticon, which is October. Uh, the Icon World Classic. I believe that's what they're calling the bodybuilding portion. I can't remember offhand, but I'm, I'm pretty sure it's Icon World Classic. And of course, the Mr. Olympia. Well, what would he do? Would he would he compete in those shows? I think as far as the the rock show, the Icon World Classic, uh, I don't know whether that's going to be an invitation uh, or you just put your name in the put your name up there and you jump into it. I don't know how it's going to work, but I think it's going to it's should be having very a uh, very enticing purse from what we hear there's gonna be big prize money and I think that it would be uh, a very likely scenario that if his legal issues are behind him and he has no enough time to prepare that he we would see him in the and the Athleticon World Icon uh, Icon World Classic in October. Uh, I think that would be a pretty safe bet. Now, with the Olympia, uh, I think he might have a bitter taste in his mouth, considering the fact that they essentially banned him from competing in the show while he had these pending legal issues. Now, this was all done under AMI. Now, Dan Solomon was already in place uh, running the, sh uh, the show for AMI uh, in 2019, but how much say he had in the matter of Road and competing or not, that I don't know. I personally would think that Dan Solomon probably spoke in favor of Roden, but ultimately he wouldn't have the decision. Uh, I think if AMI was still running the show, I don't think that Roden would want to compete. I think he good chance that he would say no and I don't want to do it after the way you treated me. But now we got a different case scenario. Uh, Dan so Solomon is running the show over there, but the people behind the show are different. You got Jake Wood, Wings of Strength, who he himself is a bodybuilding fan. It's a new ownership. Uh, I think with Jake Wood owning the promotion and with Dan Solomon running this show, I think under those circumstances, we it's a pro, it's a very high probability that Sean Roden would compete again in the Olympia. Remember, he doesn't have to qualify. He's automatically qualified uh, for life by virtue of him winning the Mr. Olympia. Uh, well, we, we don't know what's going to happen yet because as of now, uh, Sean Roden's situation hasn't changed much. Uh, 
I believe he's scheduled to appear in court again uh, in the beginning of April. If the case is dismissed or, or whatever, he would still have enough time to prepare for the Olympia. And, of course, he'd have enough time to, uh, to prepare for the October show, the Rots Athleticon, Icon World Classic. Uh, that's about it for this video. Uh, let me know what you think about what I said in the comment section. If you liked the video, please give it a thumbs up. Please share and by all means subscribe. Uh, do not forget to hit that notification bell. This way, every time I put up a new video, you will be notified. Once again, this is Michael Diamond, and I'd like to thank you for watching Muscle Central.